Resuming the custom card review streak, we're going to be talking about a uh, fusing LR Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks. It's going to be a little Goten and Trunks SSJ that goes into a Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks. I did skim through the card just a tiny bit, but uh, yeah, it's it looks pretty dope for a card concept. And it's coming in from Bart. But before I go ahead and read Bart's custom card, send me custom cards or easy A concepts over to VHDF custom cards at gmail.com so I get to your custom card as soon as possible while I'm getting all these recent custom cards and easy A concepts out the way. <laughs> Don't worry, that's not going to be inside the uh, intro every time. I'm just saying that just for today. Or maybe I'll say in the future. Who knows? Um, so I was not able to upload yesterday because my computer was having some issues but i am back today uh and we're gonna go and just jump straight into this uh this fusing lr super saiyan 3 go tanks i think this is a pretty dope uh concept so bart says got a card idea that i think is pretty unique and i'm not gonna lie i did i know i said I just i know i just i skimmed through it but i looked at the base and i see an inspiration we're gonna talk about it right now okay so um so the lr right uh, super tech strength of the next generation it's a go to and trunks of course ssj um and of course the, the youth version all right so the leader skill is or leader skills the leader skills are heavenly events three key and 200 percent across the board or time limit or rapid growth three key and 170 percent the stats of course excluding heavenly events category characters and the additional 30 percent the stats is to fuse fighters or earth bred fighters okay so it's a dual 200% leader skill one being a carnival lr type 200% leader skill and one being a dokkan fest type 200% leader skill too i do like this this is unique counter one i think this is dope so that's number one thing that i think is unique so far um oh yeah I forgot let me just go ahead and showcase the 200% percent guy i do have it pulled up um you do have uh you got gohan and piccolo almost forgot the name of that card <laughs> You do have the ninth anniversary Gogeta. Um, you do have the frauds. I love them, but frauds. Uh, we do have Krillin and Gohan that recently just got their easy. You have the just the big hitters, that being AGL Super Saiyan 3 Goku. You have Tech Gogeta. Who else do you have? You have uh who who you else who would you guys consider another big hitter? Tech Ultimate Gohan? Probably would say so. Um Tech Super Saiyan 3 Gotenks is down here. Um so this category does have a couple of very strong options to run on the team but um yeah that's really it it's like you have to run the key pieces on this team absolutely yeah um outside of that then the leader skill would be mid but yeah um heavenly events um i mean heavenly events let me just can i grab that up you are on heavenly events let's real quick take a peek um let's get heavenly events who is on this leader skill okay so um no 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 you got to get an easy a but your easy a is going to be good um you yes um you three hell no um you granted the situation sure but at this point in time no piccolo hell no um super trunks cry about it no um this guy absolutely not um you two no uh, uh yeah this this category is ass it's like outside of let's scroll down here outside of uh, super easy a tech super saiyan 3 go tanks uh who else am i skipping over i would also say this vegeta this video is pretty solid, but I'm pretty sure he's restricted by HP thresholds. Um, and this there's like only a handful of good units on this team. A very, very dedicated handful of units that are on this team that are good. So, um, leader skill for the Dokkan Fest part of the leader skill looks good. Mostly carried by the top heavy pieces on it. And then heavily events would probably be the same thing. Yeah. So the Dokkan Fest part of the leader skill is better. I'd probably have to say so. For sure because tech kojita is there i mean king and then you have agl super saiyan 3 goku is slot one a couple of turns like he's just god anyways uh let's see 12 key that being fierce clash 50 percent attack and defense for three turns and a 50 percent chance to seal so a strong 12 key and 18 key full powered double kamehameha 50 percent attack and defense for five turns and a 50 percent chance to stun so okay you double super and you have a 50 percent chance to stun and seal um that's cool uh granted i do not like the seal chance but i see where you're going with the design and then 50 percent attack and defense for five turns and then 50 percent attack and defense for three turns so a double super will be very substantial for this card so w yeah i can see it there too uh so 
Passive activates the interest animation upon the character's entry once only, and they get a 30% chance to crit with 30% damage reduction for one turn from character's entry turns. Okay. And two key and 200% attack and defense at the start of turn, a 70% chance to get three key, a 50% chance to get four key, and a 30% chance to get five key. So let's say you get lucky and all that just procs at once. Uh, then that's what? That's 12 key? That is. And this is exactly what I was talking about at the beginning of the video. This kind of reminds me of that AGL, it's that LR Goten and Trunks. Yeah, that LR Goten and Trunks right over here that have that chance to get a specific amount of key randomly at the start of turn. Yeah, I like that. If that is where you got that from, clever. Very clever. If not, then still clever regardless. I mean, that's cool. That's really cool. Um, I mean, well, this technically is a randomly because it says 5 to 10 key randomly at the start of turn, which is pretty good on an LR. But this in and of itself is, that's unique counter number two. Yeah, this is the second unique part of this card i think is cool yeah absolutely okay and uh, an additional 50 percent attack and defense performing a super attack very nice concern the fact that this card's getting attack and defensive weapon is passed to a super attack effects so that's standard a 50 percent chance to dodge as well as an additional 20 percent chance to dodge for one turn from starter turn okay and this card gets 30 percent damage reduction when going up against a int or super int type character and 40 percent damage reduction when going up against a extreme int character so this card gets damage reduction when going up against a uh, type disadvantage that's that is fire i couldn't think of the word that's why i my brain farted for a second but that's that is fire unique counter number three that is cool bro like what <laughs> bart you're cooking bro you are cooking bart uh so Launches a guarantee super when facing only one enemy, so that's very easy to get off. And launches two additional attacks that both have a 70% chance to come a super attack when facing multiple enemies. So it's just not restricted to two, three, it's just multiple enemies. I like that. Yeah, that's pretty, that's good. So you're rewarded for either facing one enemy or multiple enemies. And this card gets 90% defense after dodging an attack within a turn okay and 30 percent defense up to 150 percent with each attack dodged okay so they build up do uh, not dodge they build up defense each time they dodge and disables enemies guard when key is 20 and effective against all types when key is 24 so um not only is this card getting rewarded for getting their key but they also have quite a few strong things about them just to go start from the top um turn one they're going to have wait <laughs> That's crazy. Turn one, right? Let's say they're in their best situation. Turn one, they're going up against a extreme int character. Of course, that would be that would mean that they're type disadvantage because this card is a super tech card. Uh, so turn one, going up against uh, the specific enemy that you want to go up against in their best situation. They're going to have 70% damage reduction. They're going to have a 70% chance to dodge. And what else? That's it. Yeah, on the defensive end. And then within of course that turn they're building up defense from dodging while also getting defense within the same turn while dodging they're getting rewarded for getting key um as well as uh, them just i mean easily being able to get key they're, they're they're unique this is literally unique this is literally what bart said so up to a 70 percent chance to dodge 70 percent damage reduction granted going up against the specific enemy and if you're not going up against the extreme type uh int character you're going to be getting what's that that's 60 percent damage reduction granted that's an int or a super int and if you're not going up against that specific character you're going to just have 30 percent damage reduction within that one turn it was also that 30 percent chance to crit as well as that 70 percent chance to dodge and then onward from that first turn they're going to have bare minimum a 50 percent chance to dodge and granted, you're going to want this character to dodge, but um, they look good. This is a unique design. This really is. I like this. I really got to applaud this. This chance of them getting key, and this is up to 12 key, by the way. They can get up to just 12 key max in their passive, which is obviously very nice, as well as, of course, their two key right over here just from the start of turn. Um, that directly supporting the fact that they can get their disabled enemy guard as well as their feather being assault types. Um, w card design. So far, I, I like this. I like it off to the basis that this is very unique. I know I said that word about three times in the video, right? But this is cool. Yeah. And the link set, 
the innocence super saiyan shock and speed prepare for battle the saiyan lineage fierce battle and legendary power so prepare for battle shock and speed and the saiyan lineage it's just that's just a great combination of key links to for this card to have and the categories that they're on and they're on a lot of categories uh fusion hybrid saiyans majin buu saga join forces youth special pose rapid growth gifted warriors heavenly events uh super saiyans oh my god they're on so many categories time limit bond the friendship final trump card entrusted will power beyond super saiyan fuse fighters bond the parent and child uh earth bread fighter super saiyan 3 and kamehameha as well as full power in their active skill fusion fusion condition uh fuses and can be activated from the fourth turn for start of battle so very easy just fourth turn for start of battle and onward and super saiyan 3 go tanks so i'm going to assume is ridiculously broken uh so super saiyan 3 go tanks um his uh, new super attack effects 12 key that being galactic donuts uh stacks attack and gains 50 percent attack for one turn as well as uh, sealing the enemy and the 18 key that being god's hammer holy hell 100 percent defense and 50 percent attack for one turn guaranteed stuns the enemy too wow so if you double super you're doing a guaranteed stun and of course you're sealing the enemy wow okay so passive 10 key 300 percent attack and defense at the start of turn great uh, 120 percent attack and defense performing super attack great uh what's that uh what's that that's a 50 percent chance to dodge and crit uh, i got a bit uh messed up because i saw a chance to dodge and i thought that was just guaranteed dodge but good thing i didn't say that what i was thinking so a 50 percent chance to dodge and crit as well as uh, a 20 percent chance to dodge starting from the third turn from start of turn okay so after you get to the pretty much the next attack in turn this card's going to have a 70 percent chance to dodge all right and launches a guaranteed super just unrestricted and also launches an additional attack that has a 70 percent chance come super attack okay and launches an additional attack that has a 70 percent chance come super attack and two key and 100 percent defense starting from the third turn for start of turn okay so you just get to the third turn and you're just you get stronger as the fight goes on okay wow and launches an additional attack that has a 50 percent chance come a super attack and two key and 150 percent defense starting from the fifth turn from the start of turn okay and 40 percent damage reduction when you're facing an int or super int type character and 50 percent no that's 40 percent damage reduction when you're going because it's an int or a super int and 50 percent damage reduction when you're facing a extreme int character okay so 50 percent for extreme and then 40 percent for int or super int okay and disables the attack enemy's action once within the turn when performing an 18 key super or an activating the active skill and a feather being assault types when key is 24 okay so barrage of super attacks uh gets stronger as the the fight goes on um this uh, this is crazy uh granted you're versing the specific enemy um if you're versing an extreme and, and character with your 70 percent chance to dodge granted you're going to get to the third turn um let's just say this card has all its buffs up i mean 10 key 300 percent attack at even the sorry turn an attack and defensive buff and their passive to their super attack effect um stacking attack in a 12 key which is bananas considering the fact that this card can get up to what's that's three plus supers or four right yeah, that's one two three four that's four plus supers um so four plus supers coming out of the passive so this card can do up to six plus supers including the hidden potential system as well as the uh start of turn super attack that they first do so um damage reduction dodge four plus supers out of their kit and attack a defensive buff and their pass through super attack effect stacking attack uh, as well as getting a defensive buff for one turn um just strong strong all around disable enemy action just once within a turn for free a path of the assault types and keys 24 um and that's that's pretty much it okay and their active skill uh causes ultimate damage to enemy and within the same turn all attacks become crits and they get 24 keys so they just get a feather against all types did not that it even fucking matters considering the fact that they already get guaranteed crits so i just i don't know wow just great great i like this the design i like it absolutely um yeah just yeah <laughs> uh and uh, prepare for battle gets replaced for over in the flash understandable okay um so w design um heavily unique i love cards like this bart you did a exquisite job you did an exquisite job very nice but yeah um send me custom cards over to vhf custom cards at gmail.com so you get to your custom card as soon as possible or easy a concept well i'm getting all these recent custom cards or easy a concepts out the way i appreciate you guys for watching you guys are the best i'll catch you guys next time i absolutely love you guys all uh leave a like and subscribe if you enjoyed the video and join the 24 7 disco server link is down below in the description if you guys are joined today and that is all um, again <laughs> peace